What's up guys, I'm back with the video and this one is going to be a pretty short one, but it is important because many people ask me all the time in my Discord and in the comments, how do you make your bot multi-gilded or multi-server, right? Because the way we set it up, if you followed my tutorial recently from how to build a Discord bot from scratch, you might remember that in our config, we had this guild ID. And this guild ID was the ID of your Discord server that you want your bot in. Where do we use that? We could do a simple copy find and we'll find that guild ID is used only in one place in our deploy commands file. So in this file, this is where we deploy all our slash commands so that they're able to be used in the discord server. But we have one key thing here that we can switch to make these commands global. So instead of making them specific to a certain guild, you can make them open to any guild that your bot is in. And the way to do that is all you got to do is go down here where we're deploying the commands. See, we were previously using routes.applicationguildcommands and then we pass in the client ID and then pass in the guild ID. But we can change this instead of specifying application guild commands, we can actually just delete guild and it just says application commands. And I know that seems just like a super simple fix, but after that, we just need to remove the guild ID that we're passing in, only pass the client in. So we're no longer using that config variable. So we can remove it from up here. No need to import it. And so now if we redeploy our commands, we could test that it works. So deploy commands. Okay. So it was successful, which means this application commands works in the deploy command. Let's start the bot up. You can go ahead and invite your bot to a different server. So let's go to the meow bot, go to discord developer server. We're gonna add it as a, let's see, bot, there it is. Add it as a bot, we're gonna give it admin permissions. You guys can select whatever you want. It's gonna be a guild install. Then let's go ahead and go to that link that it gives us. Let's add it into my test server. Let's continue authorize there we go we got meowbot so now let's go to discord and you'll see in my test server here we have the meowbot just arrived okay so here's the cool thing is if you look at the meowbot server that i have so this is the one i've been using i have meowbot here let's check that meowbot works so let's do slash dog a command from our last video and there we go, we got a picture of a dog. So that is responding to our commands. Now let me go over to the server I just invited it to, so this community test server, and let's see if this command works. So slash dog, okay, this is a completely separate server. We click enter, and there we go. We get our next dog. So just like that, now our bot is available in any server we invite it to. This is a super short one, but I'm going to leave you with that and I'll be back with more uploads. And I'm also looking to do even more uploads per week than I am doing right now. Please join the discord if you ever need help on anything, or if you just want to join the community and help other people, that's always greatly appreciated. Let me know if you need anything in the comments, if you ever run into any bugs and don't forget to like the video and subscribe. Thank you guys so much and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.